through the process of uh, getting it to the mounting block. So uh, equipment you, you need for this, effectively uh, a bridle or head collar, preferably a, a dually halter, which is obviously what uh, Jody's wearing now, um, and two long lines. Okay, so we've got one long line. Um, obviously that's the, that's the lead rope. So what I wanted to do is I want her uh, a back end to, to go over. So I'm going to get it to stand here and ask her to come over when I ask her to. Initially I just wanted Jodie to come towards me as if I was stood on the mountain block. So it was an incremental way of training, one step at a time, not any pressure from the mountain block itself and getting her going in the right direction. I'm going to get Jody to turn on the forehand uh, on this this near side leg and get her, uh, her haunches to come over to me. That's a good one. So the aim is to bring her nose over to this sort of area and get her tail end to come this way. So using the same process. Yes, you're a good girl, isn't you? Horses usually remember, uh, they're quite quick to, to learn, so we'll see if she remembers the fact that if I bring her nose over to this sort of area, she'll bring her tail end over to me. So automatically you've seen that she'll she'll come to the mountain block with little or no supervision. Again, it's practice, it's being constant and consistent. Right. And do that again so to see it wasn't a fluke. to use a longer line. It's always a uh, always good idea to get your horse to ground tie as well. So if they've got a rope on and you drop the rope in front of them, they should, after training, stay where they're put. After a bit of practice with the rope, it was time to try the same procedure without the rope to see if she'd come to the mountain block on, under her own steam. Jodie and I have got our own set of visual cues and verbal cues 
so we can communicate at a distance without the need for a lead rope or any other external uh, control. So after a bit of practice we put the whole thing together and see how she does. Right, I'm going to ask her to stand and I'm going to ask her to stand and then I'm going to call her over to the mountain block and see if she does. Good girl. Stand here. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. 